Hello friends, I am Ray, and for another FE3 recording, we've got something very special today. This Hi. is... <laughs> I'm Mal. Mal's it here is very too, special. Because it's special to both of us. This is Fire Emblem Links of Time, the, could you believe it, long-awaited sequel to the actually, like, stupid popular uh, FE ROM hack of the ages in this era, Vision Quest. Like good. good old, good old Pandan. Like, uh, this has been like a uh, long time coming for both of us. Like, we're, like we have massive respect for uh, Vision Quest, both of us. We both... As an aside for people watching, it is very warm here, uh, 40 degrees Celsius, 104 F. You will have my to... AC will be on in the background. If you hear a gentle fan noise, same with my fan. Sorry. You, you will have to forgive us if our commentary is a little <laughs> bit strained due to the heat. But yes, uh, we're like I'm like super honored to be able to have this uh, opportunity to show off this sequel for that Dan's put together. He's been working on it for a while. Yeah, I ran on Division Quest before I did, and I played it on my stream uh, moderately recently, like within the last half of the year, and. It's probably just like the best originally put together ROM hack ever. Uh, uh, there, there's a few critiques that I could give it, not here nor there, so I'll save them. But it's probably like just the most clean and concise ROM hack of of, of like the modern era. Uh, I can't think of one that just is more original or just contains more uniqueness. Uh, perhaps it's just because people haven't touched the new stuff yet, but for for uh, for Fire Emblem editing, but it did, it did a very, very good job. 9 out of 10. So we have been tasked to show off the first map. It's uh, pretty rough right now, but it was as well as we can uh, make it uh, work. We'll do our best. Yeah, unexpected arrival. Oh man, I love those. Just like when Panda slid into our DMs and asked us to play this. This was very unexpected, though. Don't don't front. An unexpected arrival, but a welcome one. So, um, the uh, overview for uh, Lengths of Time is that this came from one of uh, Dan's original ideas for a scrap project that he had before Vision Quest came to be, and then it was modified to fit 20 years after Vision Quest ends. It takes place. Uh, it's all. It follows a. Uh, Kalea, this rogue princess of Mahala, who leaves her life of royalty and luxury behind to pursue her dream of becoming a merchant. She leaves with her Terran friend, Uliani, traveling, traversing between ports, scenarying kingdoms of Masta and Freyung, hiring a seasoned mercenary and sea pilot, while making use of a few stowaways to help run the ship. And of course, food talk. It wouldn't be a vision quest without food talk. So uh, she gets to Freya, and there's trouble brewing with civil with civil wars. <gasps> I know that bald man. I sure do too. He's here in spirit, our, our friend Duck. I know that bald man any day of the week. If he's not a pre-promote great night, I'll be very disappointed. He should be. Cream and sugar. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Hush, Duck. What familiar dialogue? It's like, it really is like we never left. <clears throat> I am unfortunately too used to saying Hush, Duck. <laughs> For different reasons. Nothing's a good dark roast. Uh, yeah. I am a coffee drinker. I prefer it, uh, black. I'm not particularly fond of coffee myself. I like the bitter. It's good. Uh... These are some chuds. They sure look it. Oh god, there's more. <laughs> This so we've is... got Biff, Baff, and Boff. Got it. Man, I love Double Dragon. 
Oh god. Oh no, it is double dragon. And oh, a double no. dragon punching your face. Time to duke it. I can't believe it's double dragon and and I uh a, the guy from a boy and his blob. Well, his name is Faulkner. Maybe he run maybe he runs a gym in his spare time. With I really like girl. Maybe it might be girl. Can't actually tell. Uh oh, oh, girl. There okay. you go, girl. Triple horse's mouth. Yeah. Daughter equals girl. That's the trope you know? <laughs> Not quite. Not quite. Respect the hustle, though, <laughs> Mel. Port Olive! Heck yeah, Port oh, Olive. Oh, it is, this is a pandan work through and through. I'm definitely not a fan of Olives, but I respect that hustle, too. I really hope that he, uh, like, triples down on the food references. Well, we had someone named Coriander just earlier, so... That's true. So we, we have a Coriander after talking about coffee, and now we're going to a Port Olive, so... We're getting there. This is definitely Dan's handiwork, you can tell. It has, it has his fingerprints all over it. His dandy work, if you will. Ah, quite good. <laughs> ah, familiar. First map of boat fight? Hey, familiar, familiar content, unfamiliar oh, first no. ones. Oh no. Ah, oh no, 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 no. I see. We've run into this person already. Oh, oh, oh in first map? No. No. Wabagong! Kitazawa. I hear his name in the distance. Oh no. It's the offspring of Kellogg 3.0. This music is really good. Quiet. It kind of reminds me of uh, something I hear in a uh, Super Mario World ROM hack. So, Ray, I'm going to point something out to you, that these are the most fantastic-looking soldier sprites I've ever seen in my life. These map sprites? Yeah, they look pretty good. Um, I think part of that was oh. mon- uh, part of we these were- We are back uh, to, uh, back to Pokemon TCG. I believe those were taken and used from, uh, Lion Throne, because I remember seeing them in Lion Throne. Very good, very good, very good. Oh! The instrumentation has changed it since has? this quest. Very good. I think that was supposed to be more of that. You're playing a play release demo. Please refer to the guide for all mechanical changes to the game. Mechanical changes? That was uh, uh -oh. that was uh, pointed out to us. Uh oh. On the all right, let's see him. Here we are. Oh boy. Support threshold. Okay, so that's normal. That's just the console fire emblem, got it. Support bonus. Uh-huh, that's standard. We may have changed the numbers a bit, but uh, standard formula for supports. Single, double, triple when you get A, A, C, B, A. Earth, heaven. Yeah, I added Earth Water. and heaven. Very good. Light. Added blade, moon. moon. <laughs> All class with Earth Seals. Yeah, very good. Change your weapon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stuff from this is very uh, good, very good, very good. This is stuff from uh, from still from Vision Quest. Good old holdovers. Nothing we don't know. Talking is a free action. That is a trope, you know. Isn't that real effy five hours. Yes. Yes. Fucking triangle. Okay, a little bit stronger. Two might twenty here this time. Uh huh. Just, uh, just uh, it's a, it's a better triangle. Single a RNG triangle. right there, bam. Oh right no! Right there, the equalizer. It has come. Oh no 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 no! See, the thing is, is that I feel like this is just a big in joke. <laughs> uh, Ray and I both felt that when playing Vision Quest, it was 1RN because of all the absolute horse, I don't want to swear, that went on during it. Horse haunting. So, <laughs> it was a little bit I of feel like this on. is merely, uh, just merely, merely a uh, matter of time 
By the way, capture. Yeah, uh, Links of Time uh, has uh, fiddled with the idea of having capture as a long-term uh, mechanic. I think that was one of Dan's uh, earliest ideas of just trying to t tease the idea. He hasn't really. So F so F5. He didn't it. really get, get a chance to properly implement it in Vision Quest because that would have upheavaled the entire item economy. But now he gets to try here. I can't believe Dan's just making Fe5 again. Shows I'm down for revival. I'm down for it. You know I'm down for that. As long as he doesn't bring up milk, we're all good. Another dance. No, 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 no. Put that back. Okay, so you can you can hyper steal. Yeah. This is this is Fe5. We understand. Very cool. Modified avoid formula. Oh no. Speed plus luck. AS formula. Fire Wait a more. Second. It's just speed plus luck? Yeah. Not speed times two plus luck? Yeah, speed plus luck, not speed times two. We... Why are we playing FE11? No, go back. Shadow Dragon. Real, real Shadow Dragon hours. Alrighty, interesting. Oh no. I believe there were other, other things that were mentioned that go to a uh, experience game is slower. All weapons have been restarted. That's work, currently work in progress. Everything else is also just work in progress. And the yeah. development of this started around uh, May 2020. Right after when... Vision Quest finished, he, uh, he after said. After Vision Quest version 1 was finished. So now, now... Uh, something you may want to be amused by, audience, is that uh, the reason that EXP gain is slower at the start of this is because uh, Dan is a massive fan of Dream of Five. And much preferred the... Uh... <laughs> The slow gain that uh, Dream of Five presented over the course of multiple maps, rather than quick levels. Title, oh no. Oh no! Oh yes, magic damage. Cool. Skill shove. Talk with Chiasa. Probably to recruit. It's, it seems to be about that, right? Oh, there you go, I Mo. knew it. There you go, Mo. I knew it. Now, this is a good duck breast. Well seasoned. Ruff's That's like gross what I about expected. <laughs> Ruff's like a massive hit, though. Poor, th poor guy. Ah, I like this, though. A rank raves, you know what. What's this con? 12. You are uh, that lady from uh, the first game's daughter. Tis. And spear. Ew. <laughs> Don't take me back to FE3. Miles per hour. Oh, he's a stowaway. Oh, no. Well, he's fast, at least. <gasps> Valentine. Pretty cool. Well. We'll take it. We'll take Valentine. Falk, no. Another one. Worn what? down Why by reality. There's, there's so many stowaways on this boat. I just had to get on board. Oh, he's really good. He's speed. Uh, bows are still one to two range, right? Or two. Well, uh, one to two. Geez, now two range, right? Okay. Just gotta... Panned, if you're trying to make this more like classic uh, Fire Emblem, since you'll probably watch this, perhaps consider two to three. Guide and engage. Without the one range, because that's just silly. Mm hmm. Ah! Strength and magic split! I see! I may have just noticed this. Wind! Not a PRF this time. Lara, Lara liked this post? Oh, Freelancer. <laughs> Freelancer? Oh god, this is Tearing Saga! As someone who recently finished playing Tearing Saga, if I've influenced any of these decisions. Oh. I'm so sorry. Heck yeah, blade type weapons. You have my attention. Uh, I believe that's everyone. So, let's have let's have a crack then. Play, you're the protagonist, you leave us off. Nye. Oh, 
All right. Definitely. Hit rates are real inoffensive guy. so far. Real gun hours oh. here. Where you gotta try to capture one of these guys. I should. You gotta, you gotta show it off. What do it? Hell yeah. Okay, uh, here, perhaps. Yeah, sure we can. First. Oh. Well, I'm used to sword fighters getting hit in the face, so changes to mechanics or not, this is normal. Oh. Bada bing. Yoink. Good palette. Yeah, very nice. Uh, yeah, it's fine. <gasps> it's real. Ah, uh, Return of Axe Fighter. The legacy of Arcadi. He has- he's not been forgotten. Show us how it works, Ray. Trade with the capture guy. Duck. <laughs> You sure did. I've covered wars, you know. He sure has. Just want to make this absolutely clear. The duck has covered wars. Never left. I don't want you to get hurt. Maybe if you weren't looking at your nose, you'd be able to keep a better look, uh, better care of her position. Sorry, I'm living in, in TCG right now. It's good life. And I'll do it. <laughs> Captain Ballers. <laughs> Darn it! Everything is food. That's why I keep fighting bits of fruit everywhere. Eat up, friends. It's just a fancy way to slice it open. Look at you, Squirm. Overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. Guys, you realize that's very unsanitary, right? It's okay, Ray. The seawater will clear, we'll, we'll clean it up. It's a pretty good, uh, it's a pretty good bonk. Nice and impactful. Uh oh, oh, thief. Ah, uh, it's okay, Ray. You can stop Thiff with the process of... Kill, move, recruit, kill. Seems legit to me. Assuming that this is recruit, after all. I'll have egg in my I... face if that turns out to be wrong. Well, I can't imagine they'd have a talk for the sake of talking. Then again, this is Pandan. Perhaps I can imagine it. I don't want to imagine it. I won't imagine it, and therefore it won't come true. Uh... 
back off here. <gasps> yeah, it's fine. Really I know this theme. <laughs> bom, 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 Get bom, that edge lord into your party. I detest being lied to. <gasps> God, I can smell the edge already. Why is it so familiar? Uh, Oops, uh, uh, that was a mistake. Uh, uh, uh. Whoa, that's the rewind button time. <laughs> no one will, no one will get mad at you for a misclick. We, we, we prefaced this with we are, we are most certainly expiring. <laughs> You're just getting to us. So, yeah, sorry about your uh, old man, Jasso. Can we be friends? Maybe. Eh, it wasn't Mahalo's fault. It's fine. Ah, definitely lives up to back her growth rates, right? Yeah, sure. Nice, almost same strength and magic growth. Uh oh. They have the same uh, similar bases. Hmm. Uh oh. Interesting. As expected, killing edge. So I mean, just uh, getting uh, my bearings for what's around here. Okay, uh, okay. Death, a lovely room of death. Bronze death, but till is still. All right, can you check every enemy for a second? Yeah. Uh, have you noticed something? No drops. <laughs> This this really is real FE five hours. Truly, we are playing the Fire Emblem oh Fifth. Oh my! Uh, yes, it's fine. Ah, the Age of Bronzo. Now upon us. I also see that we have not been provided a healer. Treat your vulnerabilities like lifeblood. Oh, well, oh, oh, okay. Anger and hatred are supreme. Wow, that sure is a one-shot. Bladed-type weapons, baby. These guys remind me of the soldiers from Advance War. Little bucket helmets. Oh. Oh, wow. Didn't crit. What happened? Uh -oh. Friends of yours, perhaps. Oh. Friends is a strong word. I was a bit too strong. That's that's funny, Ray. You're, oh, never mind. You're not funny at all. How's it going? What? Nice. What? I'll just hang on to you with my magic spell and tip the and the tip of the hat to you. You don't mind what? that. What? Cheers. <laughs> Not what you expected, huh, Mel? No. Blue Ferret. Oh boy. I 
be okay. I'm on board with most everything so far. Ouch. Except for that. Uh, that hurt. Oh, more on the bottom. Interesting. Decidedly less interesting. The only interesting part of this is there isn't one because I hate Pegasus reinforcements on boat maps, and this is the first map in the game, Pandan. Hey. I will throw fruit at you. <laughs> he knows how to press your buttons. I'm gonna get an apple, I'm just gonna sock you with it. It won't sound like that because it's fruit, but you get the idea. <laughs> so you can move. These overlapping ranges. I wish they ran in place for a little second, like in FE5. Yeah, that was one of my favorite little things about it. Just running in place. Doop, doop, doop. Hey, maybe you should use a vulnerary, right? I should. You have one. That's good. Looks like they have uh, five uses or something. Oh, and they heal 15. Oh, yeah. lifeblood. Things are Victor still... the gods! <laughs> Things are still as they were, as they should be. You know, this is probably unintended, but I'm getting some real uh, FE10 vibes from this. The palette helps. The, the the look of the the boat with the whole brown and the whole muted brown definitely gives the whole early game Radiant Dawn vibe. I like it. Alright, capture this. Just the one that so far is fine so far. Yeah. Not sure how I feel about the grasshopper on a horse. But, uh... I'm sure it'll grow to a fine uh, insect in time. I have no fear now. Delicious vulnerary. Nectar of the gods. Just Where's like... my early game hyper buff priest, though? Hmm. We may have to wait a couple of laps for one to, uh... No, I want buff man! The priest, though. To refill Onisim's, uh, long-awaited spot uh, and kill. Onisim's so good, though. I miss him. He was so chunked up. So, so good. See he. Pegasi! Oh, is the weapon view over characters gone? Oh, no, it's not. Okay. You were going too fast for my tired eyes. Have no fear. Blech. You must double trade, Ray. You've played FE5, you know how this works. Brave of you. Oh my! That's incredibly brave of you. In for a penny, as they say. Yeah, well, I'm sure Nicholas is not going to be in for much. That's uh, the front line like that. Eh. 
Good. Get that capture. Work it, gamer. Oh, <gasps> gate of honorary. Oh, that's super worth. Oh, Ronald. I don't miss you, but I do miss your music. I miss Ronald sometimes. I He was far too smug. That's Jerry why Alfred. I missed him. The MSG of Pokemon Rivals. <laughs> Smash Gax pose. I've, I've just realized that instead of being Hector, the, our base for our, uh, our little lady here is Ephraim. Cool that I missed, someone else can pick up that kill. Yeah, the, the, the slimmer build is uh, Telltale for Ephraim. Curse you, man fight man. Man fight man indeed. That's a strong archer. That's a real strong archer. Or a very weak freelancer. Uh, Never mind. Yeah. 18. That... Yeah. Wait, whoa. Hold on, tick. Uh, Miles is boosting him. Aha! Uh -huh. The sword. Mm -hmm. Never mind. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Sense is made. The juice, as it were. Give him the juice. Does that boss only have four moves? Nope, I'm blind. Accept my apologies at the front door. Dash of the King Wabagong. Sometimes Pandan frustrates me with his naming schemes, and then we get like Wabagong, and I'm like, all right, never mind, I forgive you. I'll take that fruit back. Especially Onderdonk in the last game. Shut up! First mate. First mate broth. First mate broth. Uh. Listen to this victory music for a second, right? No idea what this is from. It's, it's nice. A, it's a bob, but, but I have no <laughs> idea what this it's is. It's a bob from. is what it is. <laughs> All right, you got to give him the chiasa. You got to give him the the, the the chance for a boss boss combo. What if, though? Yes! Bada bing! No talking! No words now. <laughs> yes! Yes! The edge! Very good! Stop! No talking! <laughs> She certainly wears her influences on her sleeve. Too bad it all falls off from the edge of her, of her sleeves. You, you tried, right? You didn't have to. All right. Anyway, map done. Map done. Good. Good. <laughs> that was that was a very that was uh, a very pain to try. I still want to throw apples at Pandan for uh, the the Pegasi, but uh. Oh, that's a uh, oof. <laughs> that Paladin could use a little bit of work. Is that when you mouse over them? Uh. Yeah. Mouse over them. 
Yeah, we can just hover up something Ooh. like that. Alright. We don't need to uh, really look over this since we were only tasked to do show off this for the, the one map. But yeah, uh, so far, uh, very good. Very good, uh, strong introduction. I had a. Uh, so far, so gang. Had a, uh, I'm definitely feeling the Fraser vibes with it. And it uh, hey, Ray, it's this theme. Uh, it is this theme. Definitely haven't left from Vision Quest. But yeah, uh, def I definitely see the the raw inspiration of the good the good Thracia times, and I see I see what you're going with it. Uh, there's definitely a lot more. Uh, the feels this feels a lot more ambitious than uh, Vision Quest's raw raw at the beginning, uh, with the whole just trying to emulate the the old ways. And oh, I respect no. I respect the hustle. Blinking and talking frames are, are broken. <laughs> <laughs> I respect the hustle. Yeah, you're doing you're doing a good job, Dan. That's what I'm saying. There are some things that I think go a step too far. Uh, maybe it was just the first map, but not having any drops at all is is a little uh. Hmm. Hmm. But uh, I I can understand the the push for uh. Abusing the capture system, if it's implemented, you should be using it. It's a gameplay mechanic, that's how these work. It's just like it's, uh, it's just like torches in a fog of war map. If you're given them, you should use them. It's... Use the mechanics the game is presenting for you. But uh, I think even Thracia had a few droppable items. Or, am I incorrect, Ray? There were no drops in Thracia. Well, never mind. That is a game where you live on earning every every single weapon, penny, item you could grab your hands on for good oil. It is time to play Fracia GBA. Round two, Electric Cogaloo. <laughs> and stopping here on the front screen is good. So yeah, uh, so far, very good work, Dan. Hold on. Hold on, this is FF7 music. Oh my, it is. <laughs> That's pretty good. Oh wow. That's beautiful. I don't care about anything else I just said. Be beautiful, 11 out of 10. Perfect hack. <laughs> that was, uh, that's really good. Uh, so hey, I hope you enjoyed this little demonstration of lengths of time. It will take a little bit of uh, elbow grease to get out of the gate, but... Uh, It'll take some lengths of time for it to come out. <laughs> well done, Melissa. You're welcome. But uh, as the sequel to Virgin Quest, it definitely has quite a bit to live up to, but... I believe in my heart of hearts that you can easily match it or surpass with uh, the right with the right know-how and the uh, good good uh, just just the good knowledge of how everything worked from the knowledge you gained from Vision Quest. So, from just a first chapter, the only criticisms I can say is that it might lean a little too hard into FE5, and I'm not sure that's a good thing if you want to be more unique with what you're making if the idea is to just echo fe5 entirely by all means continue as you are uh as for future hopes the biggest criticism i had of vision quest was the roster was too large so i do hope that this one's roster shrinks maybe by five or ten characters compared to the last one i don't think it will <laughs> uh, uh, Pandan's goal as a hat creator was to make infinite characters so that you could play it like an Iron Man and therefore lose a bunch and still get a bunch of characters uh, going forward that were equal to level of the maps you were playing. Therefore, you would never, you know, have to worry about not having units to uh, play on that. But the biggest complaint I had was that it makes later characters feel very uh, uninteresting and uh, lacking character. Sort of like FE5. Well, hey! But that's it. Uh, Bada bing. <laughs> if he goes the, the, the final mile and throws in some fatigue, then perhaps I will complain less. Uh, but, you know, forced rotation and all that. Uh, but until then, we'll see. 
So that was that. Thanks a lot for watching this, everybody. Uh, hope you have a good one. So uh, take care now.